Hello folks, this is Kenneth. I just wanted to give a quick real world example of Keyboard Maestro on one of the many macros that I created and find useful. It's called Photo Folder Creation. So as a wedding photographer, I like to keep a particular file structure ready and organized so that when I'm importing my JPEGs, my raw images, my video, whatever pertaining to that particular shoot, I have a folder structure for that. So this is a user prompt right here to ask me for some input created in Keyboard Maestro. So I'm gonna say, let's say I'm shooting Jennifer Lopez. Let's say I'm shooting her today. I have a text snippet um, in Keyboard Maestro that does an expansion based off a string trigger that I type, which is .dt. Here it is right here. Once I do this, the magic happens. Boom. So here's my folder right here. Here's the Jennifer Lopez folder. Has my raw files my JPEGs, my web images, client, my selection, retouch full size, web size, album. So if she has a portfolio or somebody's ordering a portrait album, it's here. Um, the behind the scenes media, if I'm doing video of, of the shoot, I put that here. Um, documentation, the contract, the call sheet, whatever documentation will go here, any notes. So that's how you create that. Let's go into Keyboard Maestro to see how I actually made it. Um, the string trigger for this, as you see, I use make folder or derivative of that. And here's my user prompt, which has three variables in it. The site name, which is for the whatever company that I'm shooting it under. Um, the client info, last name, first name, date info. That's structured for this type of format of date. I use year, month, date. That keeps my files very organized. Right here is where it created, it used this to create the client folder itself. So this piece right here. Okay, so this is where my, that first raw folder, and this is the JPEG all the way down to um, the documentation folder. Those are the nine folders. Then as a lazy mechanism, I like it to open up that particular folder for me so I know that it's created and where it is and I can touch it and feel it and look at it. So that's it. Later.